Katie, what is this new veterinary feed directive that um, is also known as VFD and I've heard it starts as of January 1st, 2017 and how is this going to affect our 4-H'ers? Great question. I just received an email that defines it. A VFD is a written nonverbal statement issued by a licensed veterinarian that authorizes the use of an approved VFD drug or combination VFD drug in or on animal feed. Okay, so who does this apply to then? It's going to apply to almost anybody that takes an animal to the county fair, specifically food producing animals. So which medications are going to require a VFD in order to purchase them? Good question. So the VFD is primarily for antibiotics that used to be offered over the okay. counter that now you need a VFD in order to get. So how do we, as um, a 4-H or a 4-H parent, how do we get this VFD? It's pretty simple. You have to have a vet client patient relationship, which is something we've talked about for years in our quality assurance program. And that basically means that you, as the owner of a species, needs to have an established relationship with a veterinarian okay. within the last six months so that they know your animal well enough to prescribe something for it. Kind of like you need to go for an annual checkup. Oh, okay, so who is allowed, who can get this VFD then? A VFD can be acquired by the actual 4-H member, their parent or guardian. It can't be done by the 4-H club advisor or a senior fair board or an extension office because they don't know your livestock like you do. Okay, I know this is just some of the basic information, so where can I get a few more resources so I can get truly all the details that I need? There is a lot more to knowing what a VFD is and how it's going to impact your livestock. Check out your local extension office, your veterinarian, or even most feed stores are up to date on VFD practices because it is, again, going to go into effect January 1. All right, great, thanks. Yeah.